The Living Oceans Foundation made an historic launch here in the Bahamas at the Atlantis Resort on the weekend, marking the first year of its Global Reef Expedition, a five-year world study of the health of coral reefs in remote areas. The foundation conducted research in three areas in the Bahamas, including the Anaguas, Andros, and Key Salbanks. Our San Thompson has more. The Bahamas should be grateful to the Living Oceans Foundation, which conducted research in remote areas of the archipelago. The foundation's in-depth research led to the country's leading environmental organization, the Bahamas National Trust, calling for the protection of two areas, including Kisal, and further protection for water and land areas in Inagua. Living Oceans research shows that these areas are immensely rich in marine resources. Minister of the Environment Earl DeVoe thanked the foundation. The Bahamas National Trust has already put before the government a request to create the Kisal Marine Park. And so that will be done. The Hogstai area off of Benagua has also been proposed as a World Heritage Site by the Bahamas National Trust. It's a peculiar uh, feature in the Bahamas. Meantime, founder of Living Oceans, His Royal Highness Khalid Bill Sultan, Prince of Saudi Arabia, wants the extensive research to benefit marine resources worldwide. We go to places where we are invited officially by their governments to help them. We share, as uh, Ian said, 100% of the information with the, with the country, with the government, with, uh, with the organization. But what the government would do, that is their internal policy, which we don't want to get involved in. Captain Philip Renald, executive director of the foundation, has been leading these exhibitions and explains the importance of protecting the world's coral reef resources. The Bahamian government said the same thing about Conception Island. You know, Conception Island, the terrestrial area was protected, but not the marine area surrounding it. So they said, if you could go out and survey the marine environment around Conception Island, we'll consider creating a marine protected area. And that was a few years ago, and, and they have. That's happened. So that's, that, that is so encouraging to us, and, and it's great for us to, to leverage those types of opportunities. Following the official launch of Living Oceans Foundation Global Expedition, a 20-minute documentary of the research conducted underwater here in the Bahamas was viewed by the public at the Atlantis Theater. Cyan Thompson, ZNS News.